Ignore a school bus stop arm and you may have plenty of time to think about what you have done while sitting in a jail cell. That's the message being sent by Norman County Attorney James Brew. Despite repeated attempts by local police and school bus drivers to spread awareness and stop this from happening, there are motorists who are still blatantly violating the law. Brew says this is a serious offense and deserves serious consequences. I mean, we've, we've seen in the last couple of years, you know, when you see cars blown by buses with the stop arm out and children present blown by at about 40 miles an hour. I mean, I think there, there needs to be a um, penalty that's commensurate with how serious that is. You know, the buses here in Ada now have cameras, and they've had them for a couple of years. And, you know, when you, when you see it versus, you know, just reading on a report, it, some of them are just downright dangerous. I mean, people just blowing by. Those caught with a school bus stop arm violation will be forced to spend a weekend at the Tri-County Correctional Facility in Crookston and pay a $285 fine. The maximum penalty is 90 days in jail, but Bruce says they'll have to waive that as long as you remain law-abiding during that period. And if you're thinking that the county attorney is bluffing, guess again. Brew noted that two people have already spent a weekend in jail for the same offense. I'm Neil Carlson reporting for rjbroadcasting.com.